Shalom, I'm going to start off with giving all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bashim, Yahshai Bashim, Kakadash, the ones to the eldest and boss of great millstone. Shalom to the whole elect. Hope this video will be edifying. And uh, let's get into it now. This is James chapter 1 and verse 20. For the wrath of, the, of, of, for the wrath of man wicked not the righteousness of Yahweh Bashim, Yahshai, right? <laughs> and. <laughs> <laughs> Let's keep reading. Wherefore, lay apart all filthiness and superfluity of naughtiness, and receive with meekness the engraved word, which is able to save your souls. You see, so put off these worldly things, man. You know, actually, now something, uh, a scripture pop pops into my mind. You know, this first Corinthians. 13 and 11 when I was a child I speak as a child I understood as a child I thought as a child but when I became a man I put away childish things you see so those are childish things that you do in the world gotta put that away once you come into this truth you see because really those things those kind of things they don't profit you at all first 23 for if any be a hearer of the word and not a doer he is like unto a man beholding his natural face in a glass for he beholdeth himself and goeth his way and straightway forgetteth what manner of man he was you see so don't be like these people in the church for example man you know they say they love god this that such and such but in reality, they don't, you know, they don't do what is required of them to do, you see? They just go after their own lust, like it says in uh, First Timothy, you know? Let me see. This Titus 1 and 10, it says, For there are many unruly and faint talkers. Now, actually, let me jump to verse 16. They profess that they know Yahweh Bashim Yashai, but in works they deny him, being abominable and disobedient, and unto every good work reprobate. You see, so they act like, or not act like, they say they believe in God and stuff like that, but really, they don't do shit what the Bible tells them to do, man. They don't do shit, you know? And me saying they don't do shit, meaning like they, they ain't doing what's required of them to do, you know? You know, you, they, they don't do nothing, you know? Let me rephrase it otherwise, because it might sound uh, a bit messed up. Let me not say it like that, but they don't do what they are supposed to do. Let me just say it like that. They they. They do nothing, man, concerning what the Bible requires them to do, you know? And that's why, that's why a lot of them got to go, man, because, let me see, because in uh, Revelation it said, like, if you add unto the scriptures, you're going to get, uh, uh, you're gonna get cursed, man. Plague's gonna be upon you. You know? Let me close it off with that. Because that's really how it is, man. That's really what it is. You know? You cannot add. You cannot add onto the scriptures and think um, nothing is going to happen to you, man. You know? Because why? They lie, man. They say, yeah. Son of God died for all of us, so we, you can eat pork and stuff like that. Meanwhile, that's bullshit, man. <clears throat> right, it's here. So this Revelation 22 and 18. For I testify unto every man that heareth the words of the prophecy of this book. If any man shall add unto these things, Yahweh shall add unto him the plague that are written in this in this in this book. You see? So that's why a lot of these uh, a lot of these people gotta go man. Especially these people in the churches, they gotta go man because 
they're adding onto the scriptures, they're saying stuff that's not in the Bible, you know? And they're just completely off, man. But back to my point, don't be like these people in the churches, man. You know? Uh, do what is required of you to do, man. You know, don't start not following the scriptures anymore, man. Because once that happens, you're gonna start going off, man. We always gotta follow the scriptures. That's our guideline, you know? That's our uh, 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 navigation, man. You know, to walk in your daily based life. To know that, hey, if I do it like this, it's gonna be better, man, because that's that's how the most I want it to go, man. You know? If you do, if you do what the most I tells you to do, he will, he will uh, help you, you know, he will uh, 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 make a way for you if you're in trouble or something like that. But if you don't listen to him, if you don't do any of these things, how do you expect to, um, how do you expect to get help? You know, it's like, it's like, for example, these, these so-called atheists, they are about to be in a plane crash, right? But before they, before they in a plane crash, they start asking God for help and stuff like that. But wait, hold on. Before you went, before you got into trouble, you didn't believe in, 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 in a creator. You know, you didn't believe in Yahweh Yashai. But now all of a sudden you want to try, you, you want to you wanna ask God for help, you know, because you're in a rough situation, in a rough spot, you're about to die. It doesn't work like that, man, you see? That's why also uh, the scripture says they're going to run to and fro, man, seeking the Lord, you know? They're going to seek the prophets on the highways and byways. They're going to seek the word of the Most High Yahweh Yashai, but they ain't going to find it, man, because like, that's, that, like the scripture says in Proverbs 1, they had that time, man, you know, but the gates are going to be close, closing, you know, meaning uh, the Most High is going, going, going to put a stop to this work pretty soon, man, you know, and then when all hell breaks loose, people, they had that chance, man, you know, so a lot of these people ain't going to make it, man, you know, a lot of these people ain't going to make it. You know, because they, they, they were going after their own lust. They wanted to, they, they, they was, uh, they rather did what they wanted to do, you see, instead of following Yahweh Bashim Yashai. You know, so yeah, man, I hope this video was edifying. It was a quick video. I want to give all praise and honor and glory to Yahweh Bashim Yashai, Bashim and Kakadash. The bounds to the house, son of the of great, no son, shalom to the old for lack. I hope this video was edifying and shalom.